This is my all-time favorite camera, the Epson RD1. It's only 6 megapixels, so by today's standards it's not very sophisticated, but it still takes really good pictures if you don't need to make big enlargements, and I still like to use mine occasionally just because it's lots of fun to use. One thing that hampers the fun, though, is the battery. By today's standards, the battery life is just not very good. This is a 3.7 volt lithium ion battery, and so is this. I give you one guess which one lasts longer. I took one of my third party batteries that had lost its ability to hold a charge and opened it up by pressing all around the seams like this until I broke the seal. To attach my dummy battery to the bottom of the camera, I put the camera on a scanner and traced the base plate, made a template in Adobe Illustrator, and then I sent it off to a place called Pocono and got back a sheet of things like this. I took my base plate that I made and then I stuck my dummy battery that I had made onto it. I'm going to take my big battery and I'm going to put a little foam tape on it and then I'm going to stick that onto the bottom of my base plate. Just about like that. So to use your battery pack you just take your RD1, take the original battery out orient your base plate so that the booster battery fits inside. This fits through the slot that you put in your plate. And now I've got something that's doubly cool. I've got an RD1 that looks like an improvised explosive device and has a lot more power. So I can take a lot more pictures.